Welcome to the web tutorial Merging NSOC Files. First, let's go over what you can expect to learn. We will start with a brief review of key merging variables, followed by merging NHATS files to NSOC files, merging NSOC files within a round, and merging NSOC 2 and 3 longitudinal files. NSOC was designed to be easily merged with NHATS and across rounds for longitudinal files. Each caregiver in NSOC has a unique combination of IDs. The SPID is the sample person ID, and this allows merging of NHATS information to NSOC. In NSOC, the OPID is the ID for a caregiver of a given SP. When used together, OP and SPID allow users to merge a file at the caregiver level. Let's take a look at some examples of merging NSOC. We will start with merging NHATS to NSOC files. To merge NHATS SP characteristics to NSOC, use SPID and a one-to-many merge. Here we show Stata and SAS code. When merging NHATS SP files with NSOC files, the ID variable used is SPID. Note that in Stata code, it is a one-to-m merge or one-to-many. We also only keep cases that have a match. That is, in Stata, a merge code of three, in SAS, both data files are included in the if statement. In the next example, we want to merge the NHATS OP file to NSOC so we can bring over information on what the NHATS SP reported about the caregiver and then keep only matched records. In this case, we are merging one OP level file to another, so we use SPID and OPID in a one-to-one -one merge. Here we have illustrated Stata and SAS code for merging the NHATS OP file to NSOC. You can see we use SPID and OPID as the merging variables as shown in red, and it's a one-to-one -one merge in Stata. We also only keep cases that have a match. Next, let's take a look at an example of how to merge NSOC files within a round. Suppose you want to merge the NSOC OP tracker file into the NSOC file in order to look at non-response to NSOC. Because there is one record for each caregiver in the NSOC OP tracker file, you would use both SPID and OPID in a one-to-one -one merge. Here we show Stata and SAS code for merging an NSOC OP tracker file with an NSOC file. The ID variables SPID and OPID are used for merging, and it's a one-to-one -one merge in Stata. Finally, let's look at how to merge longitudinal NSOC files. Here we illustrate with NSOC 2 and NSOC 3. In each round, you can merge the NHATS SP, NHATS OP, and NSOC files. You can also merge the NSOC 2 and NSOC 3 longitudinal file directly using both SPID and OPID in a one-to-one -one merge. This slide shows the Stata and SAS code for this merge using both SPID and OPID. In Stata, it's a one-to-one -one merge. In this example, only cases in both rounds are retained. In Stata, this is designated with a keep statement where the merge is three, and in SAS with indicating we are only keeping cases in the longitudinal file. This tutorial was produced by Men Hu, Sarah Patterson, and Vicki Friedman with funding from the National Institute on Aging. This ends the merging NSOC files tutorial. Comments and questions may be sent to nhatsdata at westat.com.